The sports science program means to me understanding every aspect of sports and movement even better. So the sports science program means to me the possibility of getting a very broad education in sports and to allow me to work with the thing that I love the most, that's football. The sports science program means to me to understand and explain the fascinating world of human performance. Sport and exercise sciences is an interdisciplinary field where the students gain a lot of knowledge in different perspectives or from different perspectives and then they can apply this to different fields. So this scientific thinking and the application into the different domains of, of practical sport and exercise are the main skills that we are targeting at with our program. But before we start, um, I wanted to ask you if you remember the four essential body language tests. The language of our program is English and we have students from all over the world and also we have lecturers from more or less all over the world. Yeah, you have to get used to it in the beginning um, when you come from school and then yeah, everything is in English and uh, you have to get used to it a little bit. But I actually liked it a lot because it kind of gives you the, the opportunity to uh, get along abroad. You need to bring a broad interest in different topics. So you should be interested in research, you should be interested in movement, sports related um, questions, but you also need to be somehow interested in uh, mathematics and statistics. For example, you have a neuromotor that would require more uh, physics and biomechanics and also some software knowledge with programming and things like that but you also have more um, psycho psychological parts like uh, sport psychology oriented uh, more humanistics with social aspects and gender and diversity in sports so yeah I have a really big mix so I think every student at some point will find uh, their own good spot like their own uh, strengths but also some difficulties that we need to be worked on to go through it. After theoretical input in the first three semesters the students get more and more involved into practical parts of the program. So they start their own research projects supervised by the different departments here. They go into international internships all over the world and they go into little research programs where they can apply their different methodological um, learning outputs that they have gained over the time. Eins, zwei, drei. We have small groups, so we have only 30 students per year, meaning that uh, students are get to know each other very well and also the teachers or the lecturers uh, get to know the students very well. If you're interested in an internship or in a workplace or whatever, you just go to someone who you think will be able to, to do something there and they will call or help you and um, yeah, you always feel supported and I think all of us um, are somehow um, passionate about like one particular sport for there are a lot of different people from a lot of different backgrounds with in uh, yeah in different sports but still um, there's also the possibility in our practical courses to um, experience different sports uh, you don't necessarily have to be good at it but um, it's helpful to have an understanding about everything I would say we have optimal facilities here in Münster because we have an own campus for our students here and we have the sports facilities but we also have these lab facilities and we have so many different technical devices available in our lab facilities that nearly every research question related to human performance can be answered by use of our technical e equipment. Of course, we want the students to be ready for going into a PhD program afterwards. However, next to that, um, they can go in any field of where sport and exercise research is needed. For instance, in companies um, that are developing, developing um, sport materials, uh, sport techniques, uh, etc. In sport analyzing um, uh, uh, companies, in sport clubs. Uh, you know, what we're observing at the moment is that um, our students finishing the programs here are getting into jobs that 
haven't been existing five or ten years ago because we do have the technical devices, the te technical possibilities today that games can be analyzed in completely different ways, much more sophisticated and with the knowledge they gain here um, they can go directly into these settings and apply that everywhere where research is needed somehow to make sport better or to make the technical devices or applications better that are needed in sport, um, doors are widely open for the students that are finished here.